I can tell you how I experienced Prune the very first time. It was a summer day. It was hot out. And I went in a side door. Immediately, I was bombarded by the aroma. I had to take my T-shirt and put it up over my nose and mouth like a bandit. My feet stuck to the floor as if you were walking on bubble gum that had been chewed to discover that it was rat that had just melted in the hot sun over time. There was sunshine coming in from the street upstairs, but downstairs there was like one flickering, very pale fluorescent tube overhead. And then to open the walk-in refrigerator, which had no light whatsoever. Ooh, you know, that's when your own hair brushing your neck and you're just jumpy and paranoid because you think some small creature <laughs> has landed on you. The very significant thing I remember was opening a full box of apples and this cloud of black spores whew, came floating up just into my nostrils. <laughs> I'm laughing. In spite of its putrid state, it was the perfect place for me. You could really see what was begging to come out of that kitchen. 